Last week Eric Garcia was hailed as a future Manchester City leader and Felix Mecca was plucked from the academy to come on for his first team debut against Burton. Helped by a 9-0 lead racked up in the first leg, Pep Guardiola felt it appropriate to reward a handful of the club's youngsters and also give his first team stars a rest by including them in his plans for the Carabao Cup semi-final. Those that watched events at the Pirelli Stadium will have seen another confident performance from Garcia at the back and a promising cameo for Mecca further forward. Fast forward eight days and the young pair were brought crashing back to earth. At a Pride Park so bitterly cold that only roughly a hundred took advantage of the free entry, City under 18's froze. Gareth Taylor, their coach, said afterwards that there were too many issues at halftime to go into with the players, the main positive being that they were only losing by one goal. Garcia had given it away on the stroke at halftime when the lively Louis Sibley fooled him into making contact in the penalty box and worse would follow for Mecca. Angered that he was not awarded a free kick for some niggling fouls 10 minutes in the second half, he bounced around to remonstrate with the referee. He may not have expected the official would be so close, but his momentum brought them together, and a red card immediately followed. What then happened surprised everyone in the ground. Within five minutes City had not one goal but two, before spending the last half hour doggedly defending their lead with everything they had. So strong was the resistance that Derby eventually lost their cool and two home players were sent off for dissent in separate stop page time incidents. As the Young Blues celebrate an FA Youth Cup quarter-final to go with a tasty U18 Premier League Cup semi-final against United, Garcia and Mecca were reminded that their route to the top will not be linear. Felix has to learn, said Taylor. I was frustrated on the sideline, I thought the referee did give them a lot, but I'm looking from a different perspective than he is. The lads on the pitch have got to stay calm, which is difficult. He's let his guard down. Young lads need to learn these things, and sometimes they don't learn unless they fail. More of today's top city stories he won't have enjoyed the tonight, especially when I spoke to him afterward, but that's part and parcel of his learning. It just goes to show, I was speaking to Eric Garcia afterwards about the difference for him playing at this level in these lads and then going with the first team. It's a big culture change for him, and level change there's all sorts of things. I thought he showed good leadership tonight, and in any situation you know he is going to be 100% Ahmeded. He's got real good leadership qualities, 